Hello, and welcome to Living the Maker Vida. You ever find something you want to print on Thingiverse, but it doesn't quite meet your needs? Follow along as we remix a file in FreeCAD and upload it into Thingiverse. My son wanted me to print out this Minecraft orb lamp, but we wanted to use an Adafruit Feather Fuza ESP8266 and a NeoPixel Jewel in order to use WLED instead of the Arduino Nano it was designed for. We wanted to enlarge the board mounting slot and we wanted to add a couple of towers to mount the jewel higher up in the cube. Once you've downloaded the STL file, you can import it into FreeCAD. We're going to work on the bottom.stl. Here you can see the bottom plate of the cube lamp. Here's a slot we want to enlarge. And we want to remove this and put our own little tower here. And I'll select your main file. I want to go to your workbench selector. Select part. And you want to convert mesh from solid. I always leave it at 0.10. Give it a second or two. As you can see here, let's turn that solid part into a mesh made up of hundreds, if not thousands, of polygons. So like that. You want to select refined shape. Gotta put all the polygons together. Give you less of a crazy view. Now we're gonna start by trying to get rid of this little block here. There's many ways to go about this, just like there's many ways to use, you know, all the different CAD programs out there. I like to create a cube. Size my cube up. Make it more or less the size that I want to cover the piece that I want to remove. Adjust the X and Y to get it in position. Got a little bump that we want to get rid of there. You can see here it's going down a little too far into this slot. I don't want it to cut into that. So I'm going to raise it just a little bit. There you go. You select OK, you select the main part. Control down, select the block you want to remove. There you go. As you can see here, it's hollow. It didn't leave us with a solid shape. I want to convert this into a solid. fix that, we'll delete the cut. That'll bring back the two parts again. Select the main part and click on part, convert to solid. Then go back 
and repeat the make a cut of two shapes. And there you have it, a solid piece once again. Continue on and enlarge our board space. Again, we'll create a cube solid. Move it more or less to where I need it and start sizing it. I know my board's gonna be 53 millimeters by 27 millimeters. size it to the correct measurements and I slowly finagle it into place again there's many ways to do this you can sketch I'm sure there's a bunch of other ways besides that this is just the easiest way for me so I don't have to be dealing with what face is this and what face is that just a quick way to edit an STL once I have it in place I make a cut of two shapes as you see here, it didn't quite get deep enough. I could always undo, change my measurements, try it again. There we go. And now I'll repeat that same process to add a little wall here so it looks a little more balanced. We'll once again create a cube solid to create our towers.
once you have it where you want it, go ahead and go to File, Export, and go ahead and rename your STL. Go ahead and log into Thingiverse. Click on Remix. Go to My Computer. Find your STL file that you created in FreeCAD. If you have any pictures of the part once you've printed it, select those two and upload those. If there's a part you don't like, you can just select it, drag it over to remove. I had pre-typed the description and the heading, so I went over and grabbed that. Select Publish, and there you have it, your first remix. Let's go ahead and like him. Why not collect this thing? Thanks so much for watching Live in the Maker Vida. Please like and subscribe to see more Living the Maker Vida. See you soon. Just more YouTube videos.